Our Nollywood stars may be living the life today, but it wasn't always rosy. A little over a decade ago, the struggle was real as most of them attempted to join the likes of the band and Two-Face in the Nigerian music industry that was experiencing an unprecedented boom at the time. We may or may not have forgiven them for the torture, but how can we forget? Here's a little throwback to the time when some of your faves let their village people use them. Genevieve this song had a strong message on domestic violence, but its presentation was a torment to our senses. No More Tears left us with lots of tears. We love Genevieve, but she should never sing again. Nkemowo Chop Your Dollar was one of the most embarrassing songs anyone could have recorded, especially coming from an actor who was one of the top earners in Nollywood at the time. Though it gave us a good laugh, it was banned by the NBC who always seem to ban songs long after our senses have digested them. If anybody wants to go, up, my brother, I go jump up. Patience Ozoko, aka Mama G. Yes, our favorite Nollywood mother-in-law is definitely on the list. This might have been for comic relief, but we won't forget and we will definitely remind her whenever she considers going into politics that we don't need people who would share the national moi moi and divide the national cake. Please do get your PVCs. Omotola Amatola's musical venture was proof that having an acceptable singing voice and curvaceous body doesn't necessarily mean you'd be a successful musician. However, she remained undaunted to have something to do with music and has backed her son in his own musical adventure. Some people are just better supporters. Ton Todike King Tonto, as she likes to call herself these days, didn't become king without an attempt to break into the music industry. Even though we can't call what she put out singing, it went viral. But it didn't last long as during one of her stage performances, she slipped and fell and her musical career followed suit. I guess some things are written in the stars. Glad she realized quickly that singing and her alleged drug use weren't going to take her anywhere. Desmond Elliott. We'll address the song later, but first let's talk about the lace outfit he wore in this video. Even if I ever forget that Desmond Elliott attempted to break into the music industry, I can't forget that outfit. I would sooner forget my middle name. It was a gospel rendition and no, Nigerians didn't buy it. Desmond recently moved on to politics and our ears are eternally grateful. That's our list guys, we have online archives to thank for being able to unearth these cringe-worthy songs and videos as it's pretty safe to assume that the featured Nollywood stars would have burnt every known trace of their doomed foray into music. Please do like this video, follow us and subscribe to our channel, also check out other cool videos we're sure you'd love.